everybody and welcome back to Folklore Gaming where it's all fun and games. So, how you guys doing today? It's Tuesday, where I'm at at least. Um, and yeah, it's a two Whoa, did that guy just go into that mall? He did. He did just go into Sunny Mall. Anyway, it's Tuesday. It's another Mega Mall playthrough, so let's just get into it. Week two. So, did you see that? He just spent $3,900 at the mall. I keep on having to talk about malls in this game. I don't spend that much money when I go to the mall. Really, because I never have a large amount of money that I want to like go and spend at the mall. Um, because if you just go in there blindly, you could just kind of spend all your money without having a plan you know I try and have some kind of plan if I don't it's not the best time for my wallet at least for me it's great because I get a whole bunch of random things oftentimes what would happen is I would go into I would always go into forever 21 my first section that I run to run that I run to is the accessory section because I always have a struggle trying to find which clothes fits me the best in the pants section and the top section. Um, so I'm just like, you know what? I know what'll fit me every single time. Some jewelry, fictitious jewelry, obviously. Or a purse. A purse would fit me perfectly, you know? I could strap it on a cross, put it on one shoulder, just hold it in my hand. I got you. A bracelet, ooh, I could rock a bracelet. I could rock some, some hoops. Some regular danglies are my favorite. Some stud earrings, you know. I got you. But like some pants. Ugh. I have to go and I have to like try them on. And then if it doesn't fit, I'm like, ugh. I'll have to go find another pair. If they don't have another pair, it's frustrating. So, level up. Yay, Grace Hannah, get out the flip flapping way, Grace Hannah. Thanks. Home goods could now level up. Yes. It's now gonna become a home goods and Marshall's duo. No, nobody? Nobody uh nobody cares? No, okay, great. But yeah, I can't spend that much money when I go to the mall. Or barely when I go to any stores in general. It just just no. Just no. How's everybody doing today? I always end up asking. Cause I'm curious. How are you guys doing today? Um so it's been maybe a month and a half since I've been posting videos on YouTube. Woohoo! Do it, do it, congratulatory, congratulatory, congratulatory. That's a word. Do a congratulatory overlay and the celebratory sound. Woo! Woo! Yay! Yay! So clap. Yay! Yay! Woohoo! Um, yeah, it's been a I think I've talked about it before, have I? I don't know. My reasons for waiting so long to actually start YouTube, I think everybody always talks about how there's a giant like influx of YouTube gamers and the market is, they usually one particular, they use one particular word. I wanna say oversurged, but that's not a word. Oversaturated. The market is oversaturated because everybody's doing YouTube gaming, um, and everybody's just being a YouTuber now. I guess that's like a career path that children are choosing. Um, but it took me a really long time to do it, and I'm glad I finally got into it for a lot of reasons. I'm really just doing a lot more talking on this playthrough just than controlling my mall, because it's kind of self-sustained at this point. Go, yeah, bye, go home. Um, I started watching YouTube videos in 2008, back when they would, play. man, I made a lot of money. I made a hundred, I mean 90,000 today, basically, because the last time was 99. I can't add. Um, <laughs> so yeah, back in 2008, I would watch Winx Club videos because I used to really love Winx Club and I couldn't find it anywhere, anywhere, anywhere else. So, I was like, I want to watch Wings Club. So I did. And I watched Wings Club on YouTube, which led me to watch other videos. And I started watching the most popular ones. Um, some of my main favorite ones I remember watching. I always watched the Evolution of Dance video a lot. There's also a song called Word of Mouth. 
this is what everybody's i don't know why i like that video i don't know why 2008 was i was like 13 or 14 ish yeah um so you know do the math um at least i always do that when someone says your age uh yeah so i, I would watch wings club videos and then whatever video seemed moderately interesting to me and i guess word of mouth did at that time and i was like okay i want to do this because i've seen other people posting and doing stuff but in oh wait i didn't really have that the the technological advancements that i have now to upload and do things and i was like okay at some point i'm gonna do it it'd be cool whatever i would literally go on youtube and i'm saying literally i want to say i'm saying literally in the most literal way as possible as i can Boss, you know the land prep development in the park? Well, it's finished! Yay! Someone from the park has started coming to the mall! Literally, yay, yeah, it's holiday sales, yeah. I would go on YouTube every single day, and then it would continue. Um, I started more watching beauty videos, and I would watch beauty videos, oh, oh my god. Like, on a daily basis, I would watch makeup. I used to watch Michelle Phan a lot, um... And I, back when she was beginning, my sister and I used to watch Michelle Phan a lot. Um, eventually, we started watching movies on YouTube. I think I ended up watching a lot of uh, animes on YouTube. There's a one with a Peach Girl. I love Peach Girl. I don't know why I liked it so much. I just did. I'm going to stop saying I don't know why. I liked it. Dag nabbit. I was a teenager, preteen and teenager time. I was 13, so teenager. And that was the kind of stuff I liked. Don't judge me. If you do, I don't really care. Um, and I, I always had in the back of my mind that I wanted to start a YouTube channel. But I was afraid of people saying mean stuff about me. Because I have feelings. And sort of feelings. A feeling sound? I don't know what that... I don't know what a feeling sound is. Just insert something sad. Perfect. Um, thumbs up. And... And... I felt like I would mess up or I would do something wrong and I don't know. I don't know what I thought. You were called to see if well done. The national rankings are about to be announced. We came in 890 seconds last time. I wonder how well we do this year. The store with the highest sales was the supermarket with 235,400 sales. Let's go see. The overall rank. She don't know why this is her accent all this sudden. 668th, I made it at least up 200. And my prize was $200,000. Yes. Oh, yes. I can get that cinema. But yes, so that was my main fear of there being hateful comments and of me saying things and stuttering in between everything that I say. Because I'm a dweeb. And... For, I didn't know what the heck to post about. Um, no idea what to post about. What did that just say? I didn't read that. <coughs> oh, well. We're here now. So, I didn't know what to post about. <gasps> Get to the point, Lord. So, I just eventually just did it. This year, I just did it. I was looking up what the heck to do. I wanted to get a PC to make my videos. And I was like, okay, I'm going to get a PC. When I get a PC, I'm going to start making my YouTube videos. That's when I'm going to do it. That's when I'm going to do it. And I kept on just saying, that's what I'm going to do it. And uh, I never got the PC. <laughs> I haven't gotten it yet. You know, I'm hopefully going to be working towards it. I am working towards it. Not hopefully, I am. Um, Hello. I've heard good things about the rest area at a uh, mall. I was thinking about moving into the area. I'm working on a development project in the office area. If you'd like to invest, please think about it. I'll be waiting. Sexy music. What's, what's, the, what's the sexy music they always do? I don't know. Insert it. Find some sexy music and insert it. Insert everything in this video. Yay. Woohoo. Yes, yeah, so... I just ripped off the band-aid and ripped, blah, 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 ripped off the band-aid and did it. The latest mall news is out. Insert the latest mall music, 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 music. Beep, 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 beep. Back to you, Tim. Mona, Timona. 
According to our sources, a mall now boasts a new movie theater. The opening ceremony was presided over by none other than the world-famous director James Cameroon. Ha! See what you do there? Excited customers commented that before the theater opened, they had to travel to the next town to see first-run movies. We can't wait to see what a mall has up its sleeves uh, next. See what I, no? Nobody cares? Everybody is talking about us in town. We're getting really popular. We're really popular. Yeah, so I was really scared of doing YouTube videos and I just ripped off the bandit and did it. I edit with my phone. Um, I used to edit with my SE. Got a bit of a newer phone now. And it works fine for what I'm doing. I would love to transition and actually do some um, editing with a computer. But yes, I don't want to shop for these things. I don't need them. But Whenever I get the chance to, um, the future would be great. But for now, this is what's working for me, and this is what's keeping me consistent. I received a hundred thousand dollars. Yes, Pam. Thank you, Pam. So I I'm glad and I'm happy. I don't know if anybody ever wants to hear all that. <laughs> you are probably real interested. I bet. I bet. Probably not. But that's the reason as to why I started. Um, I am a. Uh, a black girl gamer. Uh, I think a lot of people don't see my face. So they're like, are you really? Is it for real? Nobody said that. I'm just suspecting. I'm just having future suspicions of what might be said in the future. No one's probably going to say it. But hey! <laughs> um, yeah, I am. I'll eventually start filming my face while I'm playing these games on my phone. Somehow I found a magical way. I'm like, how can I record but also capture my face i don't know how but i'll figure it out or i'll just wait for me to get my computer so yeah pablo p let me give him a laugh pablo picasso ah that's why he has the hat and the stash he looks like a painter no nobody his name pablo picasso Leonardo Picasso. Leonardo. Okay. Um, satisfied with our restrooms is now regular. You see? Here. Oh. I really thought you'd give me money. Thanks for the point. An avocado. Thanks. <laughs> Sorry. I really thought it was going to be something a little bit more exciting than a plant, Pablo Picasso. I was really just turned off by it. But yeah. Um, that's why I started YouTube. And uh, I'm hoping that I continue this for as long as I can because other than just being able to showcase gaming videos on here uh, I guess this is as close to gaming as I'm getting on my iOS um, I get an opportunity and a chance to kind of just talk which I don't get that often I just get a chance to just openly and freely speak and it helps my speech Helps boost my self-confidence when, you know, someone's like, hey, you did good. Or even if somebody's like, eh, that was an all right video. I'm like, you watched it and you gave me an opportunity. So that's spec flip flap and tacular. So it's, it's, it's great. Um, I'm trying to think of why else. What other reason I could think of. Um, and also the biggest one, whenever I do start filming my actual face, I think it's not a large community of black girl gamers or black gamer girls i don't know which title to utilize um on youtube period um let alone ones that really like playing retro 2d games which i have a really strong affinity for um and whenever i get around to like i said getting my pc and playing all the games that i want to play it'd be better but it's not a large market and i support any black girl gamer or any girl gamer or any gamer really out there um who's just kind of out here doing what they love which is gaming i loved gaming since i was a kid so i'm glad that even though i'm just recently starting i'm getting an opportunity to put myself out there so yes that was all i'm gonna say in this first part of my life still no i'm just kidding um in this video i think i've spoken enough so yes let's go ahead and hit the save button thank you guys for tuning in if you guys like this video go ahead and hit the like button and 
consider subscribing. I'm clearly stumbling on my words. And consider subscribing for new videos every single day. Thank you guys for tuning in again. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.